Hello everyone watching the video. We have just had the live event for Black Ops Cold War within Warzone. I'm not going to talk too much about it, but a lot of Black Ops 1 vibes. So just sit back and enjoy. We're going to shut up now. Peace out YouTube. Ascension. 7, 15, 1, 2, 19, 7, 25, 6, 13, 6, 7, 15, 14, 0. You are in a state of war, and you have precious little time to save yourself. Finish your mission. Take them down. It's a slow process, which we call active measures. The first stage being demoralization. It takes from 15 to 20 years to demoralize a nation. The next stage is destabilization. What matters is essentials. Economy, foreign relations, defense systems. The next stage is crisis. With a violent change of power, structure and economy, period of normalization. This is what will happen in the United States if you allow all these schmucks to put a big brother government in Washington, D.C. We will promise lots of things, never mind whether the promises are fulfilled or not. conflict could well be mankind's last. We want to make this a more peaceful world. Five days ago, we acquired intel. Soviet agent Perseus is in play. If he's active, something big is gonna happen. Something that could shift the balance of the Cold War. Let's go find this shithead. Uh -huh. Is the threat real? Yes, sir, we believe it is. Give Mr. Adler whatever he wants. Do I feel? Do I feel? Do I feel? This wasn't part of the plan! I know you won't fail us. Pre-order a digital copy and get early access to the open beta and instant access to the Woods Operator Pack in Modern Warfare, including Warzone.
So there you have it, Black Ops Cold War. It's getting exciting now, to be honest. Black Ops 1 is my favourite ever Call of Duty, and the fact that it's returning to its roots is very, very exciting. I'll have a lot of Cold War content coming over the next few weeks and months as we find out more about the game. Hopefully there'll be some more live events, we'll see. I'm going to look through the trailer now, see what I can analyse, see what's in there. So expect another upload tomorrow where I'll react to the trailer and hopefully we can see some things in there that I didn't see the first time. But it's looking good, it's looking exciting. All I can say then is hope everyone has a beautiful evening. Peace out YouTube.